In 2018, we produced 50 million tonnes of electronic waste globally, a figure that's set to soar to 120 million tonnes by 2050. There are around 25 to 50 billion internet-connected devices on the planet today, amounting to several per person. The amount of raw materials needed to create enough devices to fulfill demand is set to double over the next four decades. Extracting these materials through mining has social and environmental risks. And at the other end, waste from electrical and electronic equipment can contain heavy metals like mercury and lead, or flame retardants that are bad for human health and the environment. Here in Belgium, a company called Umicore are trying to make a change. In the 90s, we decided to make a huge transformation from a mining base metal company to what it is today, which is a company that is innovative, that is looking at new technology, that is trying to bring solutions to issues that the planet is having. The challenge of the recycling of the, the small electronic equipment is a very interesting challenge. And there are two billion uh, small electronic equipment that are sold on the planet. The vast majority of them are lost somehow. They're lost in your drawers. Just imagine today that you would be able to recover those two billion. You would recover about 50 tons of gold 500 tons of silver, 20,000 tons of copper and cobalt. So there is a real, real, real business case in order to sort of recover this material and to put it back into service. So we're closing the loop here. The total value of materials contained in e-waste is estimated at $62.5 billion. And Umicore aren't the only ones who are trying to find ways to recycle and reuse. Volkswagen is building a battery recycling plant to recycle EV batteries, whilst Apple has set the ambitious goal to make all its products from 100% recycled materials. For a business that wants to continue into the future, we have no choice but to invest into the kind of process and the kind of product and services we have offered. But everybody has to be into this. It is not us and others, it's the connectivity. And it's very important that everybody realizes that it is good. It is good for everybody.